excited because I'm bringing you our no chip method that we use in the salon. Now over the year I have gotten a lot of rave reviews about our no chip method. So I'm going to bring my secret to you. So when you're doing a no chip manicure the first thing you need is products. Now products are very important in no chip manicure because that's the thin line between a no chip chipping or not chipping. So I'm just going to go through some of the products that I use in my no chip manicures. The first product I use is the base coat. The base coat is really important when you're doing a no chip manicure. The base coat that I use is Jellish Foundation Base Coat. It has worked miracles out of all the base coats that I use. I use the Jellish Foundation Base Coat. That's the first product you need. You got to make sure you have a gel top coat to top off your no chip so it won't chip as fast. This is very important because this is the maybe the thin line between a no chip chipping or not chipping. The best one I've used is to top, top it off by gel. So this is what I use in my no chip manicures. The next thing you need in our no chip manicures is polish. Now I know you're saying polish. Yes, polish. In this no chip method, you can use any polish your heart desires. Essie, China Get Glaze, OPI, uh, Morgan Taylor, Simple Colors, any nail polish your heart desires you can use in this no chip method. Today we're going to be using the brand J and it's a pretty fuchsia color. So this is what we're going to be using in our demonstration. Make sure you have a cuticle oil. You're going to need that. And then make sure you get a top off your favorite bottle of polish that you're more comfortable with using. In this method you're going to need a brush which is it's going to have to be a polish brush. So you're going to need this for your no chip method. A brush and the next thing you need is our gel now this is the secret to this no chip method without this your results can be anywhere between might go right or might go wrong so our gel um, from our nail polish line is one of the first products is what you need to mix in with the polish to make it a no chip polish so make sure you have the gel that you have to get to make this a no chip polish Okay, so let's get started. So if a client has long nails, you're going to have to mix more polish. The shorter the nails, you're going to have to mix less polish. So for my client, she has longer nails. So I usually mix in a nickel amount of polish. So when I pour, I make sure I pour a nickel amount of polish the longer the nail is. The shorter the nail, a dime size amount. The longer the nail, a nickel amount. So my client has long nails again, so I'm going to mix up a nickel amount of polish. Alright, so that's about the size of a nickel. Once you pour enough polish for your client, the next thing you need to do is to mix the gel in with the polish. So, this is a, it comes in a Doppler bottle. So, once you take the gel and you get enough in the Doppler knob, you're going to count the amount of drops that you put in the polish. So, for a nickel amount of polish, you need to put six drops in. So, that's one, two, three, four, five, six. Seven. We're gonna do seven drops today. Seven drops in. So a nickel amount you take, you put, you drop seven drops in. Once you've put the gel into the polish, now it's time to mix it. So now we're just gonna mix it. Make sure that once you mix it, it's mixed very good. All right. So now that it's mixed. Now it's time to apply the polish to the client. Okay, so now that you apply the color for the client, the no chip color for the client, now it's time to put her hand um, inside your UV or LED light. I usually cure each coat for one minute. So make sure you put her hand in the light, make sure it's all the way in. Okay, so I've applied the base coat. We've applied two coats of color. 
So now it's time to do the last step, which is to apply the top it off or whatever top coat that you use, UV top coat that you use. Okay, so it's been two minutes. And now it's time to take the, the sticky layer off. Top it, top it off is it, it has a sticky layer left on it once it's cured. It has sticky layer. So you take your alcohol with your cotton ball or your lint-free wipe, whatever you have. Right now, I just have cotton balls, and you're just gonna take the sticky layer off of the no chip. So there you have it, our salon's no chip manicure method. So I've given you my secret, but let me let you know that it takes a lot of work to get a no chip that actually lasts, especially when you're doing it in a salon. So let me just reiterate a couple of points. Make sure you do a great prep, make sure the nail is dehydrated, no oil, and no dust. The next step is to make sure you have a great base coat. I use foundation base coat or whatever base coat you like, make sure you have a good base coat. Make sure you have a great top coat. I use Top It Off by Jealous or whatever Top It Off that you use. Make sure you have a good Top It Off. Make sure you have your cuticle oil. Any polish that you want to use in this method can be used. So OPI, SC, your favorite polish, where it, whether it's 99 cent or 9.99 polish can be used in this method. So your favorite polish, along with the key secret ingredient, which is the Blue Magic Gel. Now the Blue Magic Gel is something that needs to be purchased on my website, nailpassion.bigcartel.com and it comes in a two ounce bottle or it comes in a one ounce bottle. So you can purchase this or this or you can get it also as a kit which comes with either one and it also has a polished padded palette with it or a pack and a pack of orange wood sticks. So you can get it as a kit or you can buy it separate. So just just to also uh, let let you know that um, this method is something that's very important when it comes to a nail salon being cost effective. Someone at home that might want to do their own no chip manicures, whatever it is, whether you want to do them at home, whether you're opening a salon, whether you already have a salon, this method is very important because you don't have to buy not one bottle of no chip polish anymore. I remember when I first opened my salon, I used to try to buy a thousand of these polishes and it started to get really costly. So now with this method, any polish that you own, if you own a hundred bottles, 200 bottles of polish, guess what? All of them are now a no chip polish. Just with this method of mixing the blue magic gel, with any of your polishes that you have in your salon, you can also do our salon method on your clients. Make sure you follow the directions thoroughly and you'll get great results. Promise. So, again, thank you for watching my video and you all have a great day. Bye.